Now, this is very interesting. So it is the same part of the brain that processes physical pain and emotional pain the exact same way. So what that means is, you know when people say I've got a broken heart, and people are oh, just being a bit, you know, come on. Actually, it's true. There is no difference to how your brain will process a broken hand to a broken heart. The problem is, most people, unless they've done this training with me or they've done it with someone else to understand this, do not treat clients with that same amount of attention if they came in with a broken foot on crutches to if they say my heart's really been broken and I can't manage this pain. But it's the same part of the brain that processes it the exact same way. So when we're talking about someone who says, you know, um, I used to always, my parents used to always talk down to me or, or something happened and there's this kind of emotional pain that they can't get over. And we go, come on man, you're an adult, no, you, should just, you should just get on with that. Actually, no. I know people who was told by their teacher that you will never amount for nothing. And in adult life, it still holds them back. And that pain of what was said, the scars run deep. And so it's important that we understand that we have the power of life and death in the tongue. Words can kill.